new player in the team really. The rest, everybody knows all about Dorking Wanderers, so this may be a good idea, a good start for Dorking. Yeah, don't worry, you understand goal when I say goal. You'll understand that, my friend, so don't worry about that. Again, Morgan gets shut down there by Jeffers and he nearly got caught then. Got a good opportunity now. Switch of play by a lovely ball by Bobby Joe Taylor. Switching it, find Matt Briggs. He dribbles into the 18 yard box. Shoots! Are you going to keep that? Goal for Dawkins Wonder. Johnson, talking about him earlier, one of the best goalkeepers in the league. Let's it slip under his body and sneak into the goal. And Matt Briggs, with one of his first shots, gets his 60th goal for his uh, club. And uh, Dawkins Wonder lead 1 0. Deflection comes out to Wills. We find Briggs again. Briggs is calling Bender a lot of problems down there. Bender's not can't get got the pace to keep up with him. He gets round him really easy into the 18 yard box. Another shot! Good save by Johnson. And the corner for Dawkins Wanderers. And that's, has he done his ankle? Yeah, he looks like he's done his ankle there, the number seven. And again, they're on the attack. Rutherford, can he get his head up? Pulls it back. Pulls the ball back. Comes to. Oh, no. This, does really well, Rutherford. He gets in. I thought he was going to put the ball. Throw for Dawkins. Ball into Callum. Keely turns. Balls across the 18 yard box. Oh, and Rutherford gets in front of the young. <coughs> no, not. Uh, gets in front of number 18. And he drives in field from this right hand side. Finds Bender. Bender's going to have a shot. Does. Shoots, but it just goes all the, all the way across the ground and uh, goes out for a goal kick. Adibai, he looks long, finds number 16, Vice. Vice, 1v1, up against Fuller. Cuts in across the 18 yard box. Has a shot, but doesn't work. The goalkeeper flies over the bar. And another goal. Headed away by Fuller, good header. Comes out to Briggs. Briggs could have controlled it. Comes out to Wheeler. Wheeler heads it back to Briggs. And Rutherford's onside. Gets in front of her. Uh, the battle there going. Gets in the 8 yard box. Can he get shot off? Gets on his right foot. And he just scuffs his shot. And he can't. Can't, can't score a goal for Toffee at the moment. Be out for the whole season. Pryor's pulled his hamstring and now Briggs he's looked like he's put his shoulder out. Let me know. Got any good news, guys? Yeah, sorry, mate. Oh, I nearly gave you a goal then. <laughs> yeah, they've got the ball, plays it out to the left for St Albans. Ball comes in, good delivery! And Jeffers attempt on goal, but he just couldn't direct his header and it flies over the bar. Out to uh, Jeffers, Jeffers flicks it round the corner for uh, Wiltshire. Wiltshire, shoulder to shoulder, goes down, penalty! Referee's given a penalty, didn't even think about it, he never even thought about it. Sean Chambers, Jeffers is going to take it, takes it, oh, and he slots it home, making it one all. Walking Wanderers once, and Auburn City one. On the 45th minute. Ball's coming, a lot of pushing and shoving. Ball comes in, Jeff is there. Far post free! Jeff is there! Jeff is makes it 2 0, Dawkins Wanderers. And it's a sloppy. Jeff was unmarked. Jeff was unmarked in the 18 yard box. And the ball's come over from the free kick, weren't dealt with properly. I'm not sure who's got it at the far post. Put the ball across. Gonna curl it in. Puts it in near post, goes across there. Six yard box is exactly what you want. Harris plays the ball out to the left back. Nice. Bobby Joe Taylor, oh he does really well, gets away from uh, Banton then. Give it to Wheeler, Wheeler, he does give it to Wheeler. Wheeler puts a cross in, header. Oh good turn, that's the first time Rutherford driver won a header. Just skims off the top of his head and Johnson goes down to his left. And Clips it in, looking for Harris. Harris has got to win the header, he does. Comes down and he just can't find Ke Keely or... Uh, Back off a of Fuller, Bender takes the throw, Muriet wins a header, comes to, over the top to McShane, McShane, McShane hits the post and it goes off for a oh, referee never see it, comes to Goddard, Goddard took, now it comes out to uh, Akin, Akinola, can he set up Jeffers, Jeffers has a shot, oh good save by Warden, goes for it again Jeffers, Weaver's there, comes out and gathers it up and um, Concord have got one back, so it's 3 2. Now Jimmy Murray breaks his 18 yard box. Johnson's come out, and Rutherford, Rutherford bundles it in. He just bundles it in, and they expect it to all. Dawkins on to his two. St. Elvin City, two. Oh, wow. He just 
great bit of work there by Jimmy Muir. It gets to the good crossing, and Bath Rutherford just bundled it in. They give the loser ball, then they and now Jaffers get on the ball. He opens up for him, looks to his right, finds Akinola, good little turn, puts the ball in, and he meant to go across the goalkeeper, in, but he just puts it wide and be closing. On uh, McKenna does really well. Now it falls out to uh, Akinola driving forward. Bobby Joe Taylor's with him, gets it out the eye box, puts Ooh. another shot in, but it flies over the bar. And uh, again, he should have gone across the goalkeeper. Bender's there, Bender just played it down the line into Goddard. Goddard driving forward, tacking Fuller, gets to the edge of the 18 yard box. Got a call one. Oh, he tried, he opened up to look like he was going to curl it to the far post, but he just pulled it to the near post. Comes out to Noble, Noble finds his teammate Goddard. Goddard 1v1 with uh, Gallagher, finds her. Uh, Vice, Vice has a shot, but again, he's got a great shot and he just scuffed along the ground and Fuller takes a quick throw. Everything's being done at a high pace. Nice little ball there. Wiltshire catches Fuller. Cross comes to the far post. Wheel is there, bounces down and he just bounces over the top of the crossbar. And Fuller's down and Wiltshire's going to take a yellow card because that's a marking Akino Akinola. Corner comes in, far post. Headed across, goalkeeper tips it away. Doesn't get it, for him to over the bar. He never noble headed it off. Falls to draw. God, oh, but Dan Gallagher does really well. Helps his teammate out, wins the ball back. And now Fuller's in the 18 yard box. Can he get something for Dawkins Wanderers? Pulls the ball back. Yes, he can. And James, James Shea gets the winner for Dawkins Wanderers. We're into it. They've let another goal go in it in the final minutes of this game. And they're holding their hands on the bench in Auburn City. Players are flat out on the floor. They let two goals go in last weekend. And this weekend they let another go in. And that's the winner for Dawkins Wanderers, no doubt about it. And referee blows his whistle for ball side. Dawkins Wanderers win 3 2. <coughs> Excuse me, what a game it was. Unbelievable.